What's going on fellow homo sapiens? I'm David Seymour and I'm your host for Lifers. And today, uh, before we get started, I just want to explain why I call everyone homo sapiens. The scientific name for humans, modern humans, is homo sapiens. I thought that calling everybody that would unite people and make people realize that we're all part of the same species. Um, it's really surprising that we still have such rampant racism in the United States and worldwide. We're all part of the same species. Doesn't matter what color your skin is. And even if we weren't, could you imagine how terrible it would be if there were more than one species of humans alive today? We can't even get along with this, with races within our own species. If there were still a, a living if, if there was still a living human that was a different species than us, I mean, I would hate to see what would happen. I, I would hate to have seen that history. I don't know what the solution is. I just know I'm, I'm completely against anything that has to do with racism. And I wish that, uh, I wish that there was an easy solution. And I apologize to anybody who is treated differently for the color of their skin. I can't exactly, because being a white guy, I don't really know exactly what that's like, you know, being treated differently because of the color of your skin or being judged for that. I've been judged for other things, but that's completely different. I'm really tired of it. I mean, we've gone through so much We've gone through the Civil War, race riots, and we're still sliding back into the same mindless nonsense. And I, I don't know what the solution is. Part of the reason why I started this YouTube channel was to try and get people to realize that life is special and that biodiversity is truly fascinating. I thought maybe it would create a common ground amongst people. So yeah, let's get going. Let's see what we can find. There he is. Pretty interesting. Awesome. Speckled sharpshear, I believe. Oops. Check this fern out. Some kind of little pygmy grasshopper. He's gone. Sometimes you only get a few seconds. There's a beat, uh, one of the true bugs. We'll try and f figure out what this fly is. It's pretty interesting looking. And I just found these flowers. Not sure what this is. I hope it's native. There he is. Let's try to get a little bit closer. The dragonfly. That'll be our second Odonata. Beautiful. Try to figure out what he is. Another moth. All right, guys, that does it for this episode. I felt like we got pretty lucky today. Found uh, quite a few insects. Really cool ones, though. I saw a few, a few, a few different bird species, but uh, I, I couldn't get them, so we'll get them now. See you next week. What's on your list?